How waking up at 5 a.m. has changed my life. My 5 a.m. club morning routine. You know, but 5 a.m. has been amazing for me. I got more done, I was less stressed. My body is in sync, finely tuned after its optimal eight hours of rest. As I prop the final pillow up on my freshly kempt bed, I head to the kitchen where I pour coffee beans. It's important to brew fresh each day in order to enjoy nature's most beautiful beverage in the way it was intended. After jotting down each and every single aspect of my day, I head to the library where I begin my studies of self-improvement. No, I'm just messing with you guys. I'm not really that big of an asshole, but seriously. Why is this video titled Why I Wake Up at 9 a.m. when there's all these trending videos about waking up at 5 a.m.? Let's get into it. So I found these videos continually popping up in my suggested feed. Why I wake up at 5 a.m. every day. How waking up at 5 a.m. changed my life. Why I should win the day by getting up before 6 a.m. And I began to ask myself, is this really all necessary? The thing is, I consider myself to be a fairly productive guy. I run an e-commerce clothing site, I go to classes, I balance an internship, I work out every day, I eat right, and I'm doing this all without getting up early. So I began to dissect it and I figured out, let me explain why waking up at 5 a.m. every day is not for every single person and why you should enjoy the very simple things in life like sleep. This guy right here is my dog, Knox. He's a wiener dog, actually. The whole purpose of this segment is really to just keep your attention, because we all know if you see a dog, you're a lot less likely to exit out of this video. Okay, now that's out of the way, as I was saying, I noticed a trend of all these 5 a.m. videos getting virality on YouTube, and I began to ask myself, could I really be more productive if I got up at 5 a.m.? So what did I do? I started setting my alarm earlier. Although I wouldn't have class until 10 a.m. some days, and some days I wouldn't even have class, I would still get up at 5 a.m. What I found was I was actually getting a lot more exhausted and a lot less productive. So I'm what they call a night owl or a night person. It's just the way people are oriented. Some people are made to stay up late at night and some people are early risers. As much as I tried to force myself to be a 5 a.m. person, I just kept getting exhausted. I wouldn't be able to focus on tasks early in the day that I would have if I had been up late at night. Like I'm probably gonna be editing this video at 1 a.m. the night before it goes live. Now if I were up at like 5.20 a.m. editing this video as I had tried to do before, no matter the amount of coffee, I just found myself groggy. My workouts were not nearly as good as they were later in the day. See the thing is, we all have 24 hours in the day. Given that I'm more productive at 1 a.m., waking up at 5 a.m. would ensure that I would have to go to bed at 9 p.m. in order to get my precious 8 hours of sleep. This would mean I was losing all those hours that I was productive and earlier in the day when I was trying to get up and rise and grind to win the day, I was really losing because I just wasn't feeling it. No matter how much I tried to do it, no matter how much I rewatched the videos, it just wasn't for me. And it may not be for you either. Even if I'm not being productive at those late night hours, I'll still watch an episode of Netflix or two. As bad as that sounds, as, as we all want to be productive, you have to ask yourself, what is it really all for? What am I doing this grind for? Sure, it's nice to get a few things done in the day. I'll contact some suppliers, reach out to other people, get things done for my clothing company. But after I've done that amount of work, it's not gonna help me by overworking myself in the long run. It's very important to get sleep every now and then, to watch an episode of Netflix. The grind is real, but your life can't be the grind, otherwise you won't be happy. If you grind so hard that you have everything, but you have no time to enjoy it, what is it really all for? So this is my take on why I get up at 9 a.m. <laughs> That's not actually when I get up every day. I really just get up whenever I have to. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave it a thumbs up if you did. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. I did put my wiener dog Knox in there. Thanks so much, guys. Have a good one, and stay tuned for the upload next week.